वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स टू केमिस्ट्री कॉन्सेप्ट एंड नाउ वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग डार्जन ग्लाइसिड एस्टर सिंथेसिस नाउ इट इज अ रिएक्शन ऑफ कार्बोनिल कंपाउंड ऑफ अ कार्बोनिल कंपाउंड विद एन एल्फा हाइड्रोजन कंटेनिंग एल्फा हेलो एस्टर इट्स अ बिग नेम सो अ कार्बोनिल कंपाउंड लाइक सी एच थ्री सी एच ओ रिएक्टिंग विद एल्फा हेलोजन कंटेनिंग एल्फा हेलो एस्टर लाइक क्लोरीन सी एच टू सी डबल बॉन्ड ओ ओ सी टू एच फाइव सी इट इज एन एस्टर it has a halogen atom attached to the alpha carbon and it also has alpha hydrogen so it is example of a alpha hydrogen containing alpha halo ester now these two react and an epoxide is formed what happens we get ch3 c h ch C double bond O O C two H five and epoxide is formed. You can understand like this: this oxygen forms epoxide with this carbon, with hydrogen and chlorine removed, and the reagent used is a strong base like NaNH two soda lime. Let's have a look. at the mechanism of this particular reaction now there are two three steps three steps the first step is abstraction of alpha hydrogen from alpha halo ester the alpha halo ester that is cl attached to ch2 c double bond o o C two H five. Okay, when this one is treated with a base like NaNH two, a very strong base releases alpha hydrogen uh, to form Cl CH with a negative charge attached to C double bond O. O C two H five. This was the first step. In the second step, okay, the same this anion formed in the first reaction reacts with the carbonyl compound CH three C double bond O. H, this anion, this negative charge is transferred over the. Uh, this negatively charged carbon gets attached to the carbonyl carbon. This double bond is shifted here, resulting into formation of C H three C H. O negative to which C H and C L is attached. C double bond O O C two H five. This was the second step, nucleophilic attack on the carbonyl carbon. Then the third step is internal nucleophilic substitution. what happens this negatively charged oxygen replaces the chlorine atom resulting into formation of ch3 ch single bond ch epoxide c double bond 
O O C two H five. I hope the mechanism was clear to you. If not, you can always ask in our comment section. Please don't uh, forget to share this video and like it also, and subscribe the channel for more such videos on organic chemistry. Thank you.